start in the same place that we started the last walk around so you can see the difference. Obviously this was the long room that went all the way to the conservatory and as you can see it's now got a wall put up so this can now be a bedroom in this part. Let me have a look. Can you see? Can you see? Yep. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> So um, everything's been stripped out, all carpets and everything have gone. Um, this flooring in the hallway we're going to try and keep because it goes through to the kitchen. So we've put stuff down to protect it. This was mm -hmm. this was the downstairs toilet. I don't know if you remember with the door here, which was a coat cupboard. So we'll have a look in there. It's now made it into one big room. This will have a shower. Obviously the toilet will stay and the basin. Into the kitchen, obviously nothing much has, has happened here because... Um, nothing really will, will it? Nothing will happen really here. Apart from this. So the cooker's been taken out, ready for this wall to come down. Um, and again, everything's being protected because we're trying to keep everything. Not much has happened in here. They've just taken radiators off, carpets up, uh, that sort of thing. Oh, and stripped all the wallpaper. Okay. Okay, so here the builders have been digging down to find out what the foundations are like because the conservatory will hopefully become a permanent structure which will have the one of the bedrooms in there. And um, so yeah, they need to dig down to find out what what's going on with it so they know what to do with it. turning into two bathrooms so you'll have two showers two toilets two basins or whatever whichever way around um, we're gonna have to get rid of this window I think I said in the one where we explained the floor plans but yeah this window will have to go and then the doors the wall will be put back up two doors and we have two bathrooms uh, and then, so this. this was the small bedroom that we said that needed a bit of extra space um, and this is the chimney sack that I think I said uh, we came across when we were measuring. So this is going to come out because obviously it's a bit annoying in the middle of the room. Uh, not in the middle of the room, sorry, but in the middle of this space that we've taken out. Um, so yes, yeah, so this room should be, I think it's 6.8 uh, with all of this space given to it. And it will meet minimum standards. Um, and then with this section here, we're going to keep the doorway here. We're going to put the wardrobe and the chest of drawers here because there's no point having a long room so we may as well have a walkway and a walkway bed over there and then nothing else really has happened up here other than uh, radiators have come off walls have been stripped this one had a load of um, wallpaper on it i think i think they were talking about they need to actually do something with these walls because they're not very good um, it actually says up there make good so i think <laughs> that might be <laughs> They might need to re replaster this wall perhaps, it's a bit bumpy. And then, yeah, everything else has just been stripped really. There's wallpaper on that one though. Yeah. So we'll see what happens next week.